Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So like what I hated, as we have been talking about on the channel, Microsoft is in the process of moving and migrating mail and calendar app users over to the new Outlook for Windows. And just a quick video to let you know that Microsoft now has also issued a timeline where they will now automatically move Microsoft 365 Enterprise users from the classic Outlook app to the new Outlook for Windows. And Microsoft has said that starting April 2026, Microsoft 365 for Enterprise users will be switched from classic to new Outlook for Windows with the option to revert back. This change, they say, aims to enhance the user experience with modern features. I think that's going to be a bit debatable, though. They carry on to say organizations are notified to prepare with automatic rollout requiring no admin action but allowing opt-out options. Now, they do mention that they are giving more than 12 months of notice to help customers prepare. And they have mentioned that starting April 2026, users with Microsoft 365 for Enterprise licenses will be toggled from classic Outlook for Windows to new Outlook for Windows. And they also mentioned that users will be toggled into new Outlook once with this rollout, with, a, with potential to be toggled again in the future. So basically, um, if you toggle back, there's a good possibility in the future they would just automatically toggle you, toggle you back to the new Outlook. And they also mentioned that you will also maintain the ability to go back to and use classic Outlook, which I think is good. But as mentioned, um, Microsoft now intent to get as many users onto the new Outlook for Windows. That's on Windows 10 and Windows 11. And it seems now that Microsoft 365 Enterprise users now are the next to be migrated over starting in April of 2026. And obviously, I'm keeping my ear to the ground with this one. And as this information rolls in, I'll keep you guys posted. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.